Hello everyone, welcome to Ignition. Oh, that was a lot of hand movement on that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, welcome to number eight of our future vehicle competition, where if you watch the last one, all four of you, yeah, all four of you. Yeah, four is a very optimistic number. Yeah. I was thinking more like I two. I pulled out the absolutely beautiful Genesis Sentia, and I pulled out, let's say, the controversial Hummer EV pickup. Controversial. Well, some people love it, some people hate it, don't they? Well, Hummer was always like that. Wasn't yeah, it? if we it put was. a picture up, people will be able to see what we're talking about. There's the rules, and there, and there we are. The two now very, very, very different cars. Very different cars, and. <clears throat> Well, it's a very difficult one to, to discuss, really. The Genesis is probably unlikely ever to hit the roads, true. let's be honest. No, that's very true. But, wow, what a beautiful vehicle it is. Mm. That, that's very Aston Martin. It's it, That looks like a concept from Aston. It does, and the badge does look like an Aston. It does, actually, is, yeah. That is beautiful. Oh, yeah, that, that is a car you would want to have sitting inside of a garage or something, isn't it? It is. Just, just to look at. An, um, an, an old Hummer... Is, Hummer's very traditional styling, isn't it? Well, it, it looks just like the H3. That's possibly what I don't like about it, I think. Mm. It's probably too H3. When I say I don't like it... Too samey, isn't it? Uh, you know, frankly, I love it. Yeah, I you think we'd I, like it when it pulled up and it was massive. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's the width of a car length normally, but... I'm, I'm trying to, um, in this one, I'm trying to take my bias out for the vehicle that I really would want, yeah. which would clearly be the Hummer, Yeah, because it's more my type of car. Um, I don't really like supercars. Don't massively interest me. No, Never that's have very true. done for yep. whatever reason. I don't know mm -hmm. why. Probably because they're unattainable. Yes. Um, but having luckily driven a couple, I don't really like them. No, I imagine they're quite difficult to drive. Yeah. Um, but the Hummer's very samey. It's been like that for years, hasn't it? Yes. Yeah. They um, haven't. They haven't pushed the boundaries of design. Not at all. But I do quite like the styling. And if it's Electric, I think it will be a big step forward because they're they were pretty slow. Oh, and use more fuel than you can yeah. shake a stick at. So I think it's quite a good call. That is a particularly ugly one, colour choice wise. Yeah, it, it, as I think we said before, it's a bit stormtrooperish. Yes, it is. It and does. It it look, makes it look a little bit cheap. It does. But that's it a colour thing. If that was all in black, it would look awesome. Yes, you're right. So. I think I've come to my decision. I've got mine. I was I got mine straight away, and I've tried to. Um, I'm looking at it subjectively, mm -hmm. which is very rare for me. Okay. I'm trying to go with not what I really want. Yeah. And three. Oh yeah, yeah. Two. Yeah, 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 yeah. One. Hummer. Genesis. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I the Genesis is just <clears throat> taking design to a new level. It is, but it's only two seats. So no. Do, well, could be seven seats in that. Well, look at it. It's just not. I think there's four. Um, I can see two headrest behind the headrest. You reckon? Yeah. But I just don't think the Genesis is practical. The Hummer's much more practical um, in the way of a, an average person. You wouldn't be rolling around in that Genesis. Well, the average person doesn't roll around in a Hummer. You're talking out your ass. Yeah, That's no. per normal. No. It, in fact, the it's flooding out of your bum hole. No, here. but there's more people who are going to drive around in the Hummer than in a supercar. There's only one way to solve this. Rock, paper, scissors. And it's rock, paper, scissors. Can we you, remind you how to play it? No, you are gonna go down because the Genesis deserves to go through. It doesn't though. It, it, just, it just doesn't. It's pushing the boundaries of design. Yeah. It's better looking. It's better looking, I freely admit it's that. It's fantastic. But it's just not a usable looking vehicle. But anyway. But no, everyone wants it. That might be someone's second vehicle because they're minted. Right, okay. Right. So it's rock, paper, yeah. scissors. What do you mean, yeah? You always cock it up. Come on then. Rock, paper, scissors. Yes! Good. Hummer wins. Freeze. How do I always lose that? Because you're rubbish. And the Hummer deserves to go through. Doesn't. Because who's, go who's going to roll around in a car that's I'm an inch off the ground? Me. Yeah, are you? No. You, co you complained about 17 inch rims, let alone 22s. There, but they are bronze. They're you bronze. know I like bronze. Yeah. I like my rims bronze. <laughs> right, right then, the Hummer has gone through. Good. Oh, let's let's put it in the pile. And Genesis is out. Oh, I've got to now try and remember something. So I've pulled out the VW Amarac. Amarac. Oh, unlucky. Bye-bye. 
VW, because you're up against the Ferrari Puro Sangue. Oh, well done. Thank you. You pronounced that pretty well. well I, I don't know. I put the emphasis on it to well, try it makes it disguise, disguise it. Yeah. my yep. ignorance of not I'll being able it. to pronounce it. So, in the next one, it's VW Amarok versus, versus a Ferrari. Ferrari Puro Sangue. Or oh! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice like look at you. Yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.